Hi, my name is Chris Carlton with Topcon Agriculture. Today I'd like to introduce our uh, tillage depth control system. It's uh, powered by NORAC, uh, the, providing different solutions over the years for boom height control. For the spraying market, we're introducing the tillage depth control. This will allow basically any type tillage implement to be able to be automated and control. It'll help gain perspective of precision agriculture in maintaining the correct depth that you need to put your implement at without running into having to adjust stops on the fly in the field. Simply put, it's a very simple to use, easy to install, that can be installed on old implements and new, and work with just about any tractor because it is an ISO uh, type application. It's based on all of our old NORAC type history we're able to do. Makes increasing your efficiency, um, using less skilled workers if possible to do the same jobs, allowing these guys really to just focus on what they need to in the field and taking out and easing operations for them as you go. Um, you also gain fuel efficiency uses and things like that as you gain knowledge on the system. Uh, it's going to be applied over an average, but it helps you in the long run save money. Uh, the system compromises of a two sensor, a four sensor, and you have main up and down and four aft and control available in there. That allows us to get through some of the harder field elements and maintain that correct uh, setting that you want to maintain. Uh, for wearables, you're able to zero up the system. You set it down on the ground, hit zero, and off you go again. That allows us to reset and know exactly where you are for depth. Unlike using rotary sensors, uh, any position sensor within a cylinder, you'll become out of sequence and you're not actually measuring the real depth of where your tool is actually in the ground. So again, very simple, easy to use. We're excited to launch it here and it'll help us uh, in the future make tillage be a smarter application for everyone.